Memorial Day is a time for all Americans to reconnect with their history and core values by honoring those who made the ultimate sacrifice for the ideals we as Americans cherish. More than 1.3 million American service members died in the wars and conflicts this nation fought since the first colonial soldiers took up arms in 1775 to fight for our independence. But I think General George S. Patton said it best when he said that it is foolish and wrong to mourn the men and women who died. Rather, we should thank God that such men and women live. Those veterans who are here today, I say on behalf of a grateful state, thank you for your service and thank you for the continued example that you provide to our children and grandchildren about fighting for a cause bigger than your own self-interest. You are truly continuing American heroes and I bring real joy to the task of saying thank you. To reflect upon how truly fortunate we are to have been born and be able to live in the greatest example of freedom and liberty that the world has ever known. 